Okay, for this question we need to be able to understand what RAM is used for, and again, a little bit what makes a computer fast. So this is what the mark scheme is expecting you to, to write. So first of all, a large amount of RAM, that stands for random access memory, enables instructions to be loaded, um, so instructions are the things that tell a computer what to do, it's your programming code, to be loaded from secondary storage, which is like your, your hard disk, into RAM so they can be executed by the processor. So that's um, what the, the exam board's after. Let's try and explain that. Firstly, you've got primary and secondary storage. Your secondary storage is the stuff that um, can store loads of information, like your hard disk. So you generally have much more space on your hard disk than you do in RAM, which is primary um, memory, primary storage. Um, but your secondary storage is much, much slower. Although it can store more, it's much slower than the fast RAM, which doesn't store quite as much. Okay, so um, the way computers work, you end up storing all your programs on your hard disk and all your data on the hard disk until you need it. And when you need it, it gets saved um, onto your, your RAM so that your processor can deal with it much more quickly. Okay, um, so if you don't have enough RAM, that means that all of the time your computer is having to, you call it paging, um, it's getting loads and loads of information from your hard disk and then storing it into to RAM. Um, and then because it hasn't got enough RAM to be able to, to run all of your programs, it then has to move that RAM back onto the hard disk um, for the next program to be able to get stuff from the hard disk into RAM. So you've probably seen a, a hard disk that, um, like when your computer slows to a crawl and the hard disk light is flashing and it makes that horrible sort of grunting noise because you haven't got enough memory. So if you've got plenty of RAM, it means that you can store loads of instructions and data in your fast primary storage so that your processor can run it at a much higher speed.